Hello everyone and everybody, you're watching Real Russia Channel, the deepest insight into the real Russian life. My name is Sergei Baklikov and now when I record this, it's uh, Sunday, 22nd of January 2017. I'm located in the historical city center of Ufa, my hometown, the capital of the Republic of Bashkor, the son of Russia, and now right in front of Ufa Arena. This is the main hockey arena in the city of Ufa. Uh, it was built relatively not a long ago, just 10 years ago. And today this is a really important day in the history of the city of Ufa. For the first time today we have a KHL All-Stars game here. Continental Hockey League, KHL. This is the highest league in, in Russia. And even though most of the teams are from Russia, some of them are from, you know, Eastern Europe, Finland and even from China. That's why it is called Continental Hockey League. Let's get inside of Ufa Arena. Broadcasters, media press. Привет. Все отлично, ты видишь? Снимаю. Класс, сегодня будет офигенный матч. Привет, man. I arrived from co-working club, the time office. First of all, now we can see the place, the pavilion for the kids, where the adults can come to the hockey game and leave their kids under care. This section is all about, you know, free paintings on the chicks. This beautiful ladies are making the drones you know it can be the russian flag or the flag of the republic of bashkor the son of russia the ladies in the fur coats famous russian fur coats one of the buffets personalization of the hockey jersey you can order your own last name or whatever you want on a hockey jersey some hockey quizzes people respond the questions and getting some prizes mostly an items of Slovak your life but these days the um, items of KHL All-Stars game 2017 in Ufa. Official corner of Slovak Yulaev Hockey Club. This is the main team of the city of Ufa. Twice the champion of the Continental Hockey League. And that's all the cups that's ever been won of the Slovak Yulaev. Hey man, I bought Akbutin, one of the most popular photographers in the city of Ufa. Okay. Yeah, so you make the magnet in a one minute from now. It's Allah. It's Allah from Megaphone. You have to remember her. Okay, let's photograph with the ladies. Okay. Thanks so much. Man. Okay, I will get it. How are you feeling? The wardrobe. Another entertaining zone. Kumban Cafe. Guys in the traditional Bashkir costumes and hats made of the foxtail or something like that. He shoots the puck. Tractor! Tractor! That's the guest from Chelyabinsk. Chelyabinsk. Ural! Sila! Look what a bird! This is Azamat, Azamat Ushanov, one of the most advanced, skilled, 
gurus of internet marketing in Russia. And now let's get to the hockey arena itself. 10 minutes before the game will be started. The new queue made special for the widescreen formats of the picture. One of the ladies who control the tickets of all the people who are coming here. fans only as far as we can see the fans of all ages here starting from the kids to the older ladies the representatives of the press in Ufa. Just a couple of minutes before the game, the NHL All-Star game here in the city of Ufa will be started. And I have a chance to stay here right in the epicenter of this when the us are trying to entertain the public. And this year, for the first time, there will be a new format of making the KHL All-Star Games. It's not going to be just Eastern Conference against the Western Conference, but it's uh, the games between the divisions. Here in NHL we have four divisions. They are named after the uh, last name of the hockey players, Bobrov, Tarasov, Chernyshev, and of course, Harlamov. And now the show starts here. Oh, 
are playing with each other. The winners are playing in a final. Today we will see three games right in the same moment, you know? уже вас подкрою. 25 раз в секунду.
начала второго матча. Это не я сегодня сегодня стал списан, сами действительно хоккеисты оставили свой след. И еще раз, господа болельщики, господа фанаты, любители хоккея или просто знатоки хоккея, все бегом сюда. Найдете в официальной группе ВКонтакте. Люди, осталось 7 минут до начала второго матча. Это значит, что у нас... Time, the second game of you know today's series started the series of all starter games film how I film and that's what is the fun zone is all about Now it's not the final game. Many people stay outside of the arena and participate in different activities. посмотреть пин-код
Fortunately, fortunately, ambulance was not needed. one of the guys who worked really hard because steady cam it's not easy work you know как ты себя чувствуешь это не легкая работа какой вес на спину на спину все равно so this guy worked really hard anyway Bashkir beauties, the ladies in the national Bashkir costumes, you know. Понравился ли вам матч? Да, очень. Марат, земляк, земляк, привет. Behind the scenes of the hockey arena, you know. Usually maybe like, you know, 10, 12 of journalists here. But today a lot of reporters and journalists from all over the Russia. And not only, I guess. And where are you from? Just <laughs> This is Marat. Marat. He works for UTV channel and he loves to listen to System of a Down. <laughs> and I guess you understand why. <laughs> У армяне все Как тебе, как тебе новый формат игры? Новый формат покруче тем, что он хотя бы по крайней мере хоть какая-то есть принципиальность там победить, потому что прошлый матч звезд, в котором было забито больше 50 голов, как-то что-то напрягает немного. А здесь как, ну видно было, что хоть чуть-чуть стараются, чуть-чуть побыстрее катаются. Vancouver Olympic Games. Вот она. Париса, по-русски, Париса, по-русски. Здрасте. Я поняла, что это только про Ванкувер. Так ты игрок в хоккей, да? Да. Как тебе понравился новый формат All-Star Game? Да, лучше было, чем в прошлом году, намного. Так интересно смотреть. Было видно сразу, что они борются в ходе силовых приемов. Нет. Спасибо. Он, короче, собирает автографы, а потом он продаст эту футболку и... Это моему брату. Это он всем так говорит. This is a Nigel, Nigel Dose, a former NHL player, now playing in Astana, Baris. Astana is the capital of Kazakhstan Republic. Kind of common question for uh, our viewers, who are mostly from English-speaking countries. Uh, how do you enjoy living in a Kazakhstan and playing or uh, working in, in Russia and in Kazakhstan in, Cana in, Cana in KHL? It's, it's really fun. It's been, uh, it was a little bit of an adjustment at first, but uh, I've been there for six years now. And 
Um, it's, a, it's a beautiful city and uh, we're very lucky to be able to, to live there and work there and uh, oh, there's a lot of things that remind us of Canada with well mostly the weather <laughs> so we're kind of used to that but um, yeah the, the city, the team, the organization has been great and um, you know it's a, it's a really nice place to call home. Can you say that actually all those stereotypes about Russia is rid are ridiculous things. I mean, it's, it's there's. Uh, the and the yeah, yeah, the yeah. And I think, I think everyone has their little stereotypes, but um, vodka the yeah, I mean, there's a lot, there's a lot of, a lot of beer, a lot of vodka drank, and uh, maybe they have any bottles now. For yeah, me? no, it's just water. That's why so, they score so much. Yeah. So, um, but no, it's a, it's a really nice country, and uh, it's it's nice to be able to travel around and and be able to see, see different cities and different parts of the world that I never thought I'd be able to see. So. Uh, It's been a been a great six years for me. Okay, thanks so much. Так, ну что? How did you enjoy the game? Hello. Let me speak from my heart. In English. Do you like it? Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> I like it too, and I'm tired, and I want to go to sleep because it's Sunday. I should sleep at this time, but now I'm here, and I enjoy this game too. Thank you that you take an interview for me. For me, yeah. you're welcome. I like it. Thank you. You're welcome. You are the best. But not everybody knows about it. Thanks so much. Where are you from? What's mass media? I'm from Kazakhstan, press officer, Boris Club. That's why I talk with Nigel. Got it. Got it. Where are you from? I'm from Ufa, from the capital of the Republic of Bashkortostan of Russia. Do you know Ufa? Yes, of course, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> was you born in Ufa? I was born in Ufa. This is my hometown. Why do you try to speak in English? Or it's your uh, own language? Because my video blog is an English speaking video oh. blog. It's mostly okay. for an English you know, language. Uh, people from all over the world. Uh, okay, I invite you to us tonight. We will, will host okay. our okay. Yeah, all I star game. I, I invite you to do everything okay. best okay. for you. <laughs> okay, thanks for the invitation. <laughs> Максим Афиногенов. Сожалению, мы не выиграли. Золотой шлем есть, золотой медаль нет. Достойная замена. А там с 18 лет можно. Вам формат понравился? Да, очень. Я, я как бы не участвовал в других матчах, я с этому первый раз, поэтому не могу сказать, как, какое это было играть 5 на 5, 3 по 20. Но мне кажется, это много интереснее для зрителей, и как бы все равно борьбу. Хоть где-то мы выиграли в этом Всего доброго. So that's it. The first KHL All Stars game in the city of Ufa for all of the history of the city is over, and I'm really glad that uh, our division the division of Chernyshov where Slava Tulaev our home team the team of Ufa participate won that's great that's great and I hope that you really enjoyed this deepest insight into the behind the scenes of uh, this all-star game comment like and subscribe this is the real russia the deepest insight into the real russian life my name is sergey baklikov i'm going home <laughs>
Наша высшая хоккейная лига. Именно там играет этот замечательный клуб. А, так, вращаем наш лототрон. Закрываем глаза. Достаем оттуда один отрывной корешок. Итак, читаем. Да, тяжело, тяжело разобраться с тем, что здесь написано. Господа, номер 82, Арина Атуля, правильно?